I tell you what, guys, things are really starting to come together this series. We've got a good spread of dinosaurs. We've got an insanely awesome base, along with a few little extra beautiful side projects. Things are just feeling really, really good. And also, I think I think we're in the middle of a bit of a fog storm, and that doesn't really suit today's adventure, because today we're going to bust out this beast right here again, and we're going to get primal dinosaur hunting. Guys, oh, welcome back. Welcome back to our mega modded survival. Yesterday was a crazy one. We killed our first origin dinosaur and we got these beautiful gauntlets have a look at these little gold gold trimmed black i don't know what they are they're, they're a weird suit of stuff uh thanks to this guy right here who deals ridiculous damage more than we ever expected him to do this guy has exceeded every expectation we have and today we're going to use him to hopefully keep on keep on that trajectory but we're going to be using this guy to get more of these guys that's what we've got to do we're going to keep on moving forward so by killing primals we can obviously get more celestial kibble more demonic kibble tame up more demonic dinosaurs stronger than this guy even so we're just, we're just adding more and more power on but yeah that's the gist of it now i've been sorting through all of the loot we've been collecting recently and i sorted most of it out we've got a bunch of stuff here though that we're going to bust up quickly see what we get out of it using our beautiful industrial grinder over here we got a sniper we got some tools i've gone and like switched out ours as well so we got a this was the original pickaxe we got a new one now i've even got a hatchet that i went through in the um storage box container thing above you over there we got gauntlets we got shotgun shield shotgun this is my good shotgun i might not actually break this one here we got another pickaxe just give it to that too and you and a thylacolio saddle that's gonna be the tough one i don't know if we're gonna bust this one up do i ever plan on using a thylacolio i don't think we've got any special variants of them but maybe that is a good i'll hold on to that one there yeah yeah we'll hold on to that one there just to see how it goes let's grind it all up though um i wasn't even paying attention to what we got but we got a ton of loot and this fog has completely consumed us that really works against today's whole adventure yeah this this is going to be a real pain in the backside a real pain in the backside because we're going to be running around on this little shorty and we're not going to be able to see a thing. We're not going to be able to see a thing at all. But uh, anyway, oh no, I just, I'm tearing down trees and stuff. I got to make sure I don't run too close to stuff around my base. Guys, before I get too far into it, if you do enjoy the video, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you got a second to do so. And of course, go check out my merch at mrmiola.com. Just by the way, I want to propose something to you guys. What do you think about us doing a little bit of a retro throwback to the merch line I released a couple years ago? Would you, anyone be interested in picking up some of the old like, extinct designs? We had uh, the zombie Rob, and then we had like little gamer Rob. Um, old t-shirts and hoodies we released literally, I think maybe 2019, I think it was. Um, I get people asking every now and then about that sort of stuff. So if you want me to... Uh Drop those on the store. Let me know down below in the comments. All right, let's do this thing. <laughs> let's do this thing. We are going to be heading towards the swamp. Uh, the reason we're going to be doing that is because I know for a fact where two, I think they're both primal dire bears exist. There was one pretty close to where we actually tamed up this Capra Sutra. So I think we'll target that first. And then there was one closer towards where, where we found that spirit spino. Um, by the kind of like swampy castle type of village area. So I'm hoping we'll be able to find both of those. Hopefully we'll be able to get ourselves a ton of primal blood out of them as well. Uh, it's just going to be hard to navigate, especially with, well, we're in the thick swamp. Terribly thick swamp. And we've got terribly thick fog. Although it's not terrible. Like we've had worse fog at the end of the days. So we're going to have to listen out for music. Not the music you're currently hearing. Hello, Alpha Baryonyx. Goodbye, Alpha Baryonyx. Um, oh, you can still do that? All right, maybe I should be careful. Okay, maybe I'm not as safe in this swamp as I thought I was. Um, and we got that that ability. So maybe I'll just let my dude here light the place up and clear, <laughs> clear out the surroundings. Um, not going to lie, I am surprised... I didn't expect us to be able to get spear tackled off of our demonic creature. That was, that was a, that was a terrible. Sp okay, I don't know. I, yeah, that doesn't make me feel safe. Is what I'm getting at. But anyways, let's just drop a few of these. We're gonna literally wipe out this swamp, and at least we'll be able to see where we're going and what we're looking for a little clearer at least. Um, but look, I, I, oh, oh, hello. How you doing, demonic Mesopithecus? Only two kibble. Maybe I should have tamed that instead with the three kibble that we had. Hey, look, that's the whole reason we're doing what we're doing. Is that an Omega? What are you? Hold on a second. That's an Omega Sarko? I mean, I'm going to kill it, but I didn't even know Omega Sarko's existed. 
Thank you for your hide and blood, though. I'll put, I'll put some good use to that, I'm sure. Um, okay. Demonic Mesopithecus. I'm not going to kill it. I'm going to let it survive because, hey, look, the time may come. We'll be able to, we'll be able to, uh, we might look. Once we get this primal blood, maybe we can tame it. So we'll leave him be. We're not going to kill him. For now, though, I am keeping my ears peeled in hopes that I hear this primal die bear. It's meant to be, I mean, from memory, it was really close to where we tamed up this Sarko, which is pretty much this area. Unfortunately, though, I'm not hearing him. So, look, I've either overshot the area that we're looking for, or maybe it's over there, or maybe he's just moved. He's possibly just moved. In which case, we're going to head over in this direction because there is another primal diabet over here. So, we'll just go for him instead. We'll say, how fast of swimmers? That's actually really surprising. I expected this thing to be a far better swimmer than this. Also, we got 53 levels on it. So let's go and allocate these. I'm going to crank up speed a bit. Um, I can't go put any into oxygen. I was going to do that just to make him a better swimmer, but that's clearly not going to happen. And we'll crank some more into damage because you can never have too much of that, right? Let's just get it all in there. Um, and maybe five more levels into speed because speed is fun. We have 420 speed, baby. Ooh, another Omega Sarko. Level 260, this one. Oh, that would actually be, that's actually kind of tempting to tame up. Um, I don't know how strong it is. It killed it. It killed that diabet pretty quick. Omegas are kind of good dinosaurs. They actually are really good dinosaurs, especially if you get one with good stats. And supposedly by breeding them, um, you have a better chance of getting better stats. So that could have been a good avenue to go down, but oh, well, it's too late now. We've, we've ventured too far from it. This is where we want to be, though. We found ourselves this this primal die bear. Ooh, okay, just a just a dimorphodon. All good. I've still got I've still got like PTSD from dimorphodons from playing with the Dino Overhaul X mod. Uh, what midway through last year? I think we we're playing with that there. Those dimorphodons were absolutely devilish. In fact, every dinosaur in that mod was just absolutely insane. Um, still still kind of coming to terms with what went down that series. This guy. I wonder if I could kill it. 3.9 million health. That's not... Oh, I've got more health than it. Put it that way. Uh, we've got we've got pretty good health potions on us too. So if things do get a little bit bad, we could always save it. Should we try and fight the... Oh, it's not a primal. Should we fight the spirit Spino? I'm not going to lie. I'm nervous. I'm nervous about trying this one here. Uh, we also got an origin... Di Wait, was it an origin dire bear out here? I thought it was a... Oh, no. Oh, no. There he is. That's what I'm looking for. Hey, that's not a die bear. That's a megatherium. Anyways, it's only got 2.6. Wait a second. It's a demonic. I thought it was a primal. Oh, what am I even doing? I'll say, that's coming for me. He's coming for me. Oh, are we, are we really going to fight another? Are we really going to fight another origin? Are we going to? Oh, man. Oh, he's breathing fires over there. Um, Okay, then, buddy. I mean, he's 100% coming over here to fight, right? We can do it. We can do this. This Megatherium, I really want to tame it up and not kill it, but I, I, I feel like we're not going to have a choice, are we? All right, let me just let me just perch it up here. Oh, we got the little one coming for us. Giant peg of mass decks. Um, yeah, this guy, he wants me. Wait, everything wants me. Wait, what in the world? Why is everything... Okay, why is everything coming to fight me right now? Um, I didn't... What, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? What have I done? Why is legit everything trying to fight me right this second? <laughs> Look, I'll, I'll play. I'll play along. Let's go. Let's do this thing. Origin Diabet, mate. Your time has come, unfortunately, for you. I didn't think we were going to be doing this, but we're here now. Let's go. This thing's got 230 million health. I can't remember what yesterday's Kano had. Hopefully less than that. And hopefully today we don't run out of uh, stamina. Oh my gosh. I can't even know what's happening. My computer is 100% going to crash, right? Oh, I think the demonic megatherium actually got into the mix just then. Also, I'm getting damaged. All right, we're just going to keep doing what we're doing. Um, I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, it would have been handy to power up before entering this battle, but too bad, I suppose. We're, we're, it's too late now. Uh, stamina is absolutely getting demolished. Um, yeah, this die bear. Hopefully, he's getting demolished too. So am I. All right, I'm going to have to get these over here. I should have crafted up more health potions. Um, all right. Well, potions are ready to go. I'm going to have to use one in a second, though. All right, we're going to use one now. I'm not going to wait any longer. So we got to wait. Oh, it's dead. Oh, wow. Okay, well, that was a waste of a health potion then, wasn't it? Dude, we got some sweet tech stuff just there. Also, I I don't know if I should have 
harvested him normally. But dude, we got a Goliath origin flak chest piece. What? Well, yeah, I guess we'll equip it. Mine's about to break and it's a lot better than mine. We also got another origin soul. We got the die bear tribute and some more origin blood. Nice. We're going to fight this guy too. I mean, this guy doesn't have a... He's not going to give me a choice, is he? And like, I'm a little bit nervous about when he uses his attack because these, these guys are crazy. I also don't... You know what? While I'm healing up, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's have a look at what happens here. Does he have damage reduction or what's the story? Nah, he's going to die. He's going to die really quick. As long, I just don't want to get hit by one of his attacks is the only thing here. Hold on. I don't know where he went. Um, I don't know where... I don't even know if it's alive. <laughs> I don't even know. All I'm seeing is giant flashes of light over there. Is he dead? I think I killed it. Did I one-shot it? I think I may have. He's not moving. I think... I think we did it. Did I kill our very first spirit? Oh, okay. That was a risky one. <laughs> I had a little mini heart attack. I just wanted to make sure I got the loot from it, I, which I didn't. Okay, there we go. We've got the loot. And with it, we got some pretty sweet loot. Um, What did we get out of that? Hold on. We got elements. A good amount of it. Um, Okay, chest piece. We got we got this stuff here. This is good. We got primal darts and primal arrows. This stuff's going to be ridiculously helpful for us. Oh, that's about it, really. <laughs> that's about it. Maybe some other stuff. I'm not too sure, but... Cool. Okay. Well, that's another origin down, uh, which is nice. Of course, we got the origin down. We've got the reverse spirit down. That guy went down really, really easily, but we haven't found any primals yet. So I guess we need to keep on looking. What happened to the primal die bear though that we came, we came out here to find? Well, not this one, the other one, the second one. One of them obviously ended up being an origin slash megatherium demonic. Uh, but what happened to the first one I was looking for? I have no idea. We must have run straight past him. I guess we'll just like venture through the jungle and see what we can find. I'm sure there's, there's got to be something out there, right? These origins, I mean, well, even the origins, like not that we're looking for an origin, but they obviously don't spawn commonly, but there's got to be some out here, right? Even same for primal, same for demonics. They're all very random, but jungles are generally not very safe places. And since I am not looking for very safe dinosaurs, we may as well hit up some of these not very safe places. And just see what we can find. Oh, please don't tell me that's another Rudolph. It is another Rudolph. <laughs> I got my hopes up. I thought the red glow was going to be something I was actually looking for. But nope. It's Rudolph. And he's cruising through the jungle for some reason. Why is he cruising through the jungle? I have no clue. This doesn't... Ooh, Thylacolio. Is that an Omega Thylacolio? Okay, no. Just a regular one. I was going to say, what's the bet? We find ourselves a really... Oh, it's a Parasa. I thought I saw it, uh, 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 the, the Megapithecus. I thought, sorry, not a, big, a gigant, wait, Gigantopithecus? No, Megapithecus. I thought I saw a Megapithecus just cruising through the jungle. I was like, yo, a boss we might be able to tame. But no, unfortunately, it is not. Hold on. I just heard explosions. I swear I just heard an explosion. There's a lot of fighting dinosaurs out here. Yeah, no, there's explosions. I can see, I can see the glow. I can see the fire. What is it? What's fighting down here? There's definitely fire down here. I just kind of wanted to see what we're dealing with first. Something is glowing up. Demonic Megatherium. Should we just kill it? We're going to need to kill demonics to get hired for saddles and stuff like that. We may as well. Um, where is he though? There he is. <laughs> He's so intimidating, man. Even though we just killed one like literally a second ago. We may as well just do it. Oh, he does pretty good damage of his own, but not enough to stop me because I'm indestructible, baby. Seriously, I kind of am, though. This Capra Sutures is just on another level. I, I'm I, I'm absolutely shocked at how strong this thing is. Also, I thought I saw some more glowings down here, but I guess not. Just another Parasa and the sun shining through the forest. All right, let's have a little look around. We got Kanos. We've got a... We got more Karnas. There's a bunch of everything, really. Let's just kill it all. A fabled dude. Let's kill him too. Actually, I just had an idea. Nope, that's not my teleporter. Let me grab my teleporter. I'm going to teleport. Let's go to the green obelisk. So right outside of our base, or at least like right behind it. There was a primal Kentrosaurus that was kind of like dancing around when we tamed up our fabled Argy and fabled Dodecurus. Let's... Oh, this isn't where I thought it was going to be. Um... 
I actually have no idea where I am. I think I've got to scale this somehow, except I can't climb rocks because we just break them. Um, okay, okay, hold on. I think down here is the water, right? Then how... Oh, man, how am I going to get up? I need to somehow... Uh, this isn't terrible, actually. We're a long way from where I'm trying to get to. I'm trying to get to like over there, but if I can break this rock, which I can't. Okay, that's not very helpful then. What do we think? What I think we could do is just go like this. Whee! <laughs> I need to get up there basically. And I guess I should just be looking around and seeing if we've got any other primals and stuff in the... We're just sliding straight down the mountain. Never mind. Cool. We'll run up this little trail here. Now, I hope this guy's still up here. I haven't touched him. Haven't gone anywhere near him. Haven't done any... There should be no reason that he's not up here basically. Unless the game just decided to remove him, which has happened i think it happened to the dire bear that we were looking for just a second ago but let's hope it hasn't happened this time also i should probably be careful uh there he is yep no he's alive all right and you can already hear the music there he is primal kentrosaurus only 27 million health so i should be able to just run up right here drop a little exploded bob all over the shop and i'm taking damage from damaging him because that's how this whole system works where did he go and he's still taking damage. <laughs> what? Did he get like caught on fire or something? Because I didn't expect to kill him with a single shot. Ah, uh, that's crazy. Also, look at all the metal down here. Dude. No, don't harvest him. Stop that. I need to do it myself to get the most blood I can out of him. 73 blood though. Hey, that's enough to do quite a bit with. Okay, that's actually really good. I... Okay. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, okay. You know what? We actually might be able to do some stuff here. Um, that's a lot better than I had expected. Let's head back to base. I'm just going to teleport straight over the top because it's the quickest way home. There we go. Um, yes. Okay. Let me let me just let me just suss out what we've actually collected from today's journey. Uh, we got a lot of stuff I could probably just break down, which I will do. But I've got you. I've got you. We've got a pretty sick helmet. I'm going to wear that. Yes, I am. Uh, speaking of helmets, I really got to get around to crafting up some uh, other Alpha and Apex armor. We, we I've been sitting on that for so long. I don't know why I haven't done it yet. Um, and then pretty much everything else that's good is in my inventory currently. So let me just drop the blood in here. I can't believe how much we got. That's craziness. That's so good. Let's drop our little souls in here. And... I often get people saying that we should um that I should be using the arc automated mod where it like automatically kind of distributes items and stuff like that. I'm actually considering it because it's a very helpful mod to use. I'd, it's very underutilized on this channel. So maybe I should get around to doing that, installing that. I think basically what happens is you can just configure it and then you I don't know interact with an item and your entire inventory gets split to where you want your items to go, which is helpful cuz I like my stuff distributed in a certain way. But um, anyways, yeah, whatever. What else have I got in here that we can get rid of? Let me get rid of my element. Uh, we got berries. Let's just get rid of the berries. I don't need no berries right now. Uh, we got a bunch of ammunition, a bunch of arrows and stuff that I can't use because I don't have a compound bow. Um, and that'll just about cut it, I think. All right, let me just get rid of those. Get rid of those. We got blueprints. That's pretty sick. Goliath primal compound bow. That's a blueprint I could actually use. I don't think I can afford it. Or can I? Hold on a second. I'm going to try and craft this up. This might be an all new way for us to deal pretty insane damage uh, or, or torpor. Wow, that's expensive. I mean, I know it's expensive, but I thought we might be a little bit closer than that. Okay, we are nowhere near ready to use that. Good to know, though. Good to know. Um, yeah, these ones here can all get chucked out. And I guess I'll just break the rest of it down. Cool. Helmet on, of course, too. And you know what? While I'm here, what other... Uh, let's have, a, let's have a look at armor, okay? Uh, Apex. What? Oh, primal. Now that I've got blood. But this stuff's not actually that strong. It's only got 400 armor. You really need to find it in the wild. Otherwise, which is... Okay, now I'm just, it's just clicking to me like one piece at a time. It's the whole reason we've got this stuff in here. So if we did want to craft this up, I've got just enough blood to do it. But then we can't go and tame stuff. So probably not the best idea. Um, if I've got some... Hmm, leggings... Now nah, we're good. All right. All right. All right. Let's just see if we can get some kibble, I suppose, and go from there. I think, though, we might try and go and get that Mesopithecus. Not 12. I only needed two. Well, we can only get three anyway. What am I missing for more? Hold on. We'll find out in a second. If I did want more, fabled eggs. 
Where am I meant to be getting fabled eggs from? Who's my fabled egg layer? It's one of the Dodies, or is it our Argy? Male. Female. Are you not delivering me eggs? Why not? <gasps> I didn't reactivate you. Wait, you're not even powered. Wait, how long have you not been powered for? Let me fix that. We'll give you some fertilizer. Hold on a second. How long has this just been sitting here not doing anything? I moved it, by the way. But I actually have no idea. Either way, this thing's powered now. It's going to boost the production of our dudes. Uh, yep, okay. You've got a few little spares there going as well. All right. Now, you can all go back to laying eggs, please. And thank you very much. Especially you. I need you to lay eggs. <laughs> I need you. I need eggs. Like, not now. We don't need them right this second, but we need them soon. All right. We've got two kibble. Fantastic. Um, I guess I just need to be able to knock out this Mespithicus. Which we've got darts. Why? I need bullets. I need bullets. I know I've got my bullets in here. All right. I'll go and drop this stuff off for now. And let's see what bullets we've got. We've got little black ones. We've got the blue ones. And we've got the, these ones. What happened to my red ones? Did I use them all? I guess we did because we've been using weaker ones. Dang. That stuff was good. All right. We'll stick to dark blue ones, I suppose. We're going to bust out my little horsey over here. And we're going to try and get this demonic Mesopithecus. Add to our little demonic army. This might go wrong. But uh, if it does, we'll cross that bridge when we get there, I suppose. We'll, we'll one step at a time. Regular Alpha Kano down there. Whenever I see something glowing, I get excited. As if, like, we've just found another primal or something. But nope, it's always a letdown. When we don't want to find a primal, we find primals. When I want to find primals, they're nowhere to be seen. It's pretty much the, the, the go around here. But there he is. That beautiful little monkey. And by little, I mean he's freaking enormous. He's only a level 110, so he's not ridiculously powerful, but that don't matter. I'm not going to discriminate. All I'm going to do is pop some arrows into bullets. We're going to pop bullets into him and keep our distance because this guy will wipe the floor with us. So we need to be very careful because his special ability is one of the best. It's one of my favorites, and I don't want to be anywhere near him when he uses it. <laughs> I don't know if he's going to use it. Will he? I kind of want, I want you guys to see what this thing can do. I want you guys to witness the demonic Mesopithecus in action. Actually, I gotta be careful here because I can get dismounted from my dudes. All right, we'll put some more bullets in him. He's not going to do it though, is he? Come on, man. I want, I want you to demonstrate. Show us what you can do. Is he going to do it? Is he going to do it? Is he going to do it? <gasps> okay, hold on. <laughs> that scared the liver the headlights out of me. <laughs> okay, come on, dudes. Show us what you can do. It's so impressive. I should not be down here right now. But it doesn't matter. Let's anger him. And then get ourselves out of here. Yes, I'm a wimp. What can I say? I'm a little scaredy cat. I don't mess with monkeys. Monkeys are crazy. I've already got him halfway down though. We're running out of bullets, but we'll have, the, we'll have him down soon. He's just... Uh, nobody's messing with him. Hey, Sarko. Do you want to you fight the monkey for me? Do you want to get him nice and angry? All right, let me just land. Sarko is going to come for me instead. Of course he is. All right, go away, Sarko. I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm busy right here. Oh, no. That Sarko is actually dealing crazy damage. <laughs> My poor horse nearly died. Wow. Okay, that was a lot stronger than I expected it to be. Um, cool. So don't mess with the crocodiles either, I suppose. I'm shocked that he's not firing shots up at us because he has a very crazy rank, uh, ranged attack that I fully expected him to use on us. Or at least I was prepared for it. But nah, I guess he's uh, he's got some better judgment. Anyways, let's uh, let's keep going with these bullets. We're about to run out. Oh, he's running. Ooh, we got him on his toes already. 300. I only got 100,000 left to go. All right, let's bust out these ones here. Yep, we're going to save the black ones. I don't want to use our um, our primal ones just yet. They're too valuable. Um, but uh, he's doing the exact same thing that our Capro did. Literally running into the forest. Making my life hard. I got I to gotta follow you into like unknown territory. That doesn't sit well with me. But I don't have a choice either. There he is. Oh, no. Um, all right, let's just, let's just keep him going. Come on, a few more. There he is. Come on. Can't be many left. Oh, he's got to be on his toes, right? He's got to be on his final legs. Yeah, he is. Where did he go? He's over there somewhere. There he is. There he is. Is he still gaining torpor? 440. I think he's still getting a little bit, but he needs another shot or two, I think. 
All right, let's have a look. Where did he go? I've legit lost him. I hope he fell asleep, but I don't think he did. Where did he go? Um, he shouldn't be hard to find. I mean, he's, 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 <laughs> he's covered in flames and all that after all. But I can't see him. Did he stay in the jungle or did he go back to the swamp? Uh, I might have lost him. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. No. Come on. He's like a giant shadow. I mean, that kind of works in his favor and hiding from us. But he should be, he should be standing out like nothing else. Unless he did run back out here. This is asleep and I just ran straight past him or something. Oh, my gosh. I've lost him. Hold on a second. He's behind us. Is he asleep? Hold on. No, he's, he's still awake. Not for long, though. He's asleep. Oh, no. I hit the E button. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not like this. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. All right. All right. I need your help, Unicorn. I need your help right this second, Unicorn. Um, This is not good. Uh, Please come down right now. Please come right down. Please come down. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop, stop, stop. Okay, we're alive. <gasps> how did we not just add to our death counter? I have no idea how we survived that, but we did. This Baryonyx just decided to ignore us for some reason. Look, mate, just, just get out of here. Just get out of here, mate. You two, this guy here is going to try and pounce me off. I'm waiting for it. All right, we got to get out of here before it's too late. There's this... Oh, okay. I got to make sure all these guys don't go and damage my monkey. Come here. Come here. Come here. Let's go. Let's go. All right, get out of here. Is that everybody? I think that's most of them at least. All right, let's just get in and get out as quick as possible right now. Bam, there you go. Bam, there's your kibble. And bam, can I ride you home or what? There we go. The demonic Mesopithecus is ours. And I'm on his back. That's as simple as that. I am riding the stronger of our guys home. Even though I'm on the ground, I'd probably be better off in the sky. But um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy to just do it like this. My unicorn can fly following me. And I've got a giant monkey. So win-win. We're all happy, right? We're all a happy family. All right, let's get... Uh, wait, what? Wait, what just did that? Oh, no. All right, can you guys stop? I'm going to die. I'm actually going to die. I'm actually going to die. I, what is happening right now? Let me on top of my monkey. Um, oh, no. Maybe I should stick to the sky. Okay. That's, oh, dude. Are you for real? Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I died. I died to a Caprasuchus. you got to be kidding me. I roam around on a Caprasuchus all day just fine. And we get killed right at the end. <laughs> That's so annoying. <laughs> oh, well. Hey, I just unlocked something. I heard the, the noise. Also, this is, our first, this is our first time spawning in the new base. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Well, let's get out there. Let's go and get out, guys. I should have just teleported back to base, but I feel like it's cheaty doing that, which is why I tend to run home from base normal. Well, yeah, no, that's generally what we do whenever we tame a new dinosaur. But anyways, let's go and get out, guys. We don't have to go too far. Um, hopefully. I don't know why the mess the case ain't. There it is. Oh, <laughs> yes, there it is. That is the demonstration that I've been waiting for. I told you his attack is something to marvel at. He just wiped out that area. That entire area. He just took out an entire swamp with a single attack. And that is why we tamed up a Demonic Mespithicus, guys. That is the exact reason we tamed up a Demonic Mespithicus. That's what I was trying to mount him so I could then use that attack. But things just weren't working out. Anyways, let's get both my dudes. I'm waiting for my Mega Raptor to follow me. And let's get all four of us back home. Hey, I think that's a fantastic idea. I bet you we lose one of these flyers on the way just because they just fly all over the shop and get lost. Uh, but let's use this. All right, so let's have a look at his attacks right now. We've got left click, which is just melee. We've got a right click, which is throwing poop. Wow. Okay. I didn't know that was his explodey attack. Okay, then. Um, I guess maybe, maybe that, that is that the attack? What about C? Wait, what does the attack do? Did something. X does nothing. Control does nothing. Oh, okay. So his right click attack is his crazy. Basically, he throws poop and it just explodes into a mortar strike and then just absolutely annihilates everything in the area. Yeah. 
pretty crazy, right? It's pretty much what our Caprasuchus has been doing, except faster, wider, bigger, and maybe even stronger. But we'll have to uh, we'll have to do like a little comparison. I'll say, yep, I called it. We left one of our guys behind. The Mega Raptor, he's been uh, he's been left behind for whatever reason. But I'll have to go and get him in my own time. He's yeah, he chose to get lost. That's not my problem. But we'll, we'll catch up with him another time. And just like that, we have ourselves a second demonic dinosaur. But tomorrow is where things are going to get really, really fun. Because now that we've got these two and we've got that all that primal blood, all we're going to do is wait for fabled eggs to be laid. And we should be able to get us some celestials, some really strong high level demonics even. Things are just about to get crazy. Guys, we're going to end this one right here though. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. If you haven't yet done so, subscribe to the channel. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.